Welcome back. Today I'm going to be having a look at a puzzle sent to me on Facebook by Ben. Thank you, Ben. Do have a look at Ben's website. It's got some fantastic puzzles on there. They all seem to be themed, which is brilliant. Love a themed puzzle. Uh, ben is from Australia, I believe. So I think this might be the first time we've had a look at an Australian puzzle on the channel. I'm hoping the theme isn't too Australian, otherwise I might struggle. But uh, anyway, let's go. Link is in the description. Do have a go yourself at this and some other of Ben's puzzles. They look fantastic. Lovely website as well, Ben. Okay. Lived among fish. Sheltered. Lived could be was. Existed. Lived. Sheltered. No, don't know. An unproductive dig, but you might do it for cover. Duck. Don't know. Small scrap could grow into gigantic rumble. Small scrap could be small is often S. Gigantic rumble. Don't know. Bad start. Somewhat misanthropic as someone who had a blue period. Picasso. That is somewhat. Uh, I mean, somewhat means part of this phrase, misanthropic as someone, and Picasso famously had a, a blue period, didn't he, in his career as a painter. Right, now this looks thematic, doesn't it? Quiet uprising, all, all streets in chaos. On 11.22, they were agitated about... Right, we're definitely coming back to that one. Retired with money, that is, socialist. Communist fits nicely. Retired with money. Don't know. C clan falling apart. Looks like anagram. With differences on all sides. Scalene. That's a nice clue. A scalene triangle is one that has a different length side on each of the three sides. It's an anagram of C clan. Lingered longer than you started, which is bad. Lingered longer than you stated, I mean. Which is bad. Over something. Lingered. Over. Slept. I don't know. Before damaged unit left. Until. Yeah. That's an anagram of unit and L for left. Damaged is the anagram indicator and before is until in some context, I suppose. Right, so it's this one and this one. Bog side, 30th of January 1972, which the Widgery Tribunal described duly as nobody at fault. Oh, I've heard of this. Um, Widgery Tribunal. This doesn't look very uh, cryptic, does it? I wonder if this is just a straight definition. Bog side. I think it's ringing some bells, but I'm going to have to get some letters. Right, lacking humour about second person from the past. That would be second person from the past is the old fashioned word for you, which is thee or thy. Lacking. Or thou. Without, yes. Yeah, it's thou, second person from the past, sec old fashioned word for you, and then. Humour is about it, W-I-T, wit, and the whole thing is lacking, without. Lived among fish, sheltered, was. I don't know. I want to say duck on this one. This might be something to cricket. Angry about just one colony resident. Um... An ant, possibly. Getting nice stuff for breakfast. Yeah, ant fits. Angry about just one colony resident getting nice stuff for breakfast. Could be an angry uh, anagram of angry. Hmm. 
Ah, I don't know what nice breakfast food is. Agitated, with delirium largely returning. Agitated, riled, something like that. Oh yeah, riled, it is. It's, uh... Ah, I can't type today. Here we go. Riled. It's, um... Backwards in the word delirium. And largely means it's more than half of the word delirium, I suppose. Backwards. Coward. Yes, it is coward. That just means, um... Sort of found shelter, you coward somewhere. That's an R, of course. And that is were, which is lived. Uh, inside cod, fish. Small scrap could grow into gigantic rumble. Some crumb, that's a small scrap. Oh, it's here, isn't it? It's hidden in gigantic rumble. Grow into, I suppose. Oh, a small scrap could grow, I think, is the definition. And then it's into means it's inside this. That's nice. Crumb. So what's this? Um, Bloody Sunday? Was that in 1972? That was an incident in Northern Ireland, wasn't it? Where did the British Army... Uh, kill some protesters or something. And um, famously, nobody was found at fault for it. Yeah, I reckon that's it. So is that the... Is that our theme, then? I don't know a lot about it, but... Uh, let's give it a go. This looks like duck. I reckon it's duck. You do it, duck for cover. An unproductive dig. I wonder if that's a cricket reference, because a, a duck in cricket is when a batsman goes out, scores no runs and is dismissed and I wonder if uh, a dig is a, a spell as a as a batsman possibly I don't know maybe that's Australian slang right reprieve with the French setback the French le la normally reprieve oh. they are rewarded being of real use at work of real use anagram. Do I have an anagram helper here? Don't think so. They are rewarded. So it looks like an anagram of of real use. I'll just stare at that for a moment. They are rewarded. I don't know. Need some letters. Complete state. Utter. So double definition, the word utter means complete, and it means uh, to say out loud, to, to utter something. Harnesses, yolks, reports of rich non-white. <laughs> Very nice, yolks. That's uh, referring to the part of the egg, of course. Almost a litre drunk in experiment. Almost a litre. Trial. Almost. A litre drunk. Oh, I see. It's, um, take the phrase a litre, it's almost a litre, so we ignore the last letter. Drunk, anagram, and we get trial, an experiment. Yeah, that's nice. Dug in on issue, leading to downfall. Don't know. Doctor. University identification for member of learned elite. That's DR, doctor, university, U, identification, ID. And a druid would be the member of the elite, I suppose. Dug in on issue leading to downfall. Leading to downfall could be D. Don't know. Media piece was essentially incitement. Media piece was essentially incitement. Item. Like um, an item in a newspaper or something, and it's uh, the middle part of the word incitement. Strange images involving a bit of refraction, mirages, that's an anagram. 
Yeah, strangely, I'm going to go to. Oh, is it? Oh. Oh, I see. That clue's much cleverer than it looks on first glance. It's what's called an and lit, where the whole thing is the wordplay and the definition simultaneously. Those are very hard to write. So, well done, Ben DR. That is a superb clue. So, it is an anagram of images and R, which is a bit of refraction. And the whole thing is also a definition of what a mirage might be. That's brilliant. I space G is always in. Undying, dug in. Dug in on issue leading to downfall. Undoing is a downfall, isn't it? Let's write that in, have a look. Oh, it's an anagram of dug in on. Is it? Yeah. Issue must be an anagram indicator then, okay? Right, good, not too much thematic stuff so far. That's probably a good thing. Uh, right, mint tenor badly, anagram, resulting in being locked up. Um, in, in, internment, intern, yeah, internment. That's being locked up, isn't it? Internment, it's an anagram of mint tenor. One I try to reform, anagram. Which first battalion, 1512, which we haven't got either of, secured on Bloody Sunday? Right, so it's an anagram, probably. One I try two. Which first battalion, something something, secured on Bloody Sunday? Um, what is this going to be? Notoriety? N-O... I think it's notoriety. Yeah, so this is a reference to the, the British Army. They did certainly gain notoriety on that day. Retired with money, that is a socialist. Socialist is red. That is, it's probably going to be IE, the Latin phrase, I, id est, IE, with money, retired, cashiered, money is cash, does cashiered mean retired, maybe, don't know, all oh, right, quiet uprising or streets in chaos, on Bloody Sunday, they were agitated about internment without Trial. <laughs> we got all of those already. People that were agitated about internment without trial on Bloody Sunday. Quiet uprising, all streets in chaos. Is it... Uh, I was going to say it's an anagram, streets, all streets in, but there's no P. Oh, quiet can be P, can't it? As in um, the the in music, piano means quiet. Upright. Oh. Oh, that is that's a great clue. I think it's P, and then uprising because it's a down clue. Uprising or means R O. And then the rest is anagram streets protesters on bloody sunday they were agitated about uh, internment without trial that's amazing what a great clue angry about just one colony resident getting nice stuff for breakfast Cross is angry. Cross. No, it's croissant, isn't it? Very nice stuff for breakfast. So cross is angry as cross, and that's about just one. 
I, one, Roman numerals, and then colony resident, ant, and you get nice stuff for breakfast. This looks like cashiered then. Cash is money, that is, i.e. socialist, red, retired, cashiered. I'm not familiar with that, but I reckon that's right. King, meeting disaster in military unit. Uh, R or Rex for King. Regiment. Looks likely, doesn't it? I bet that's a part of a thematic one as well. King meeting disaster. Yeah, it's King R and then uh, anagram of meeting. Disaster is the anagram indicator. Regiment. Lingered longer than you stated, which is bad. Outstayed, probably. If you outstay, you're welcome. That's bad, isn't it? Lingered longer than you stated. Uh, not quite sure how the cryptic part works. Uh, is it an anagram of you stated? Yeah, I think so. I think it's the anagram of you stated, and bad is the anagram indicator, and the definition is lingered longer. Very nice. This is a fantastic crossword. Endure wars chaos. That looks like an anagram. You could be invested in some of it. You could be invested in some of it. No, I don't know. Need some letters there. Using a cape hurt badly. Warrior might fly more safely with this. Not sure. Um, have we done all the thematic ones? I think so. I want to see 11. Yeah, done that. Right. Endure was chaos just to look at that. Withdrawing careless remark about Nicole briefly, lying low. So it probably ends in ing. Don't know. Agitated by troubled nuts. Troubles require getting SOS out. Troubles, I wonder if that's a reference to the old theme as well. Agitated by... No, no, no. Cups set out for Reverend Green, perhaps. Suspect. Cluedo. Reverend Green is uh, one of the suspects in the board game Cluedo, and it's an anagram of cups set, I believe. Gets out of shape. What you get for getting into bad meds. Gets out of shape. What you get. Looks like an anagram of meds with something inside it, perhaps. Oh, is it deforms? D-E. Yeah, let's have a look at that. Deforms. So that is an anagram of meds with four in it. Four, getting into bad meds. So the definition is gets out of shape what you get. Not quite sure what the what you get is part of there, but uh, yeah, I think that's right. Gets out of shape, deforms. Withdrawing careless remark about Nicole briefly lying low. Don't know. They are rewarded being a real use at work. That's that anagram that I couldn't see. 15, that one's got 15 in it. Want that so, which the 1st Battalion something regiment secured? Something regiment, parachute regiment? Oh, yeah it is. Warrior might fly more safely with this parachute, surely. <laughs> That's an excellent definition. And, oh look, it's an anagram of a cape hurt. I think. Using and badly are both anagram indicators, are they? I don't know, but I think that's probably going to be parachute. Parachute regiment must have been the soldiers involved.
can draw wars chaos. You could be invested in some of it. I think that is underwear. That's an anagram of endure war. You could be invested in some of it. I suppose that means you're wearing it. Reprieve with the French set back. Reprieve. Oh, I don't know. What's that? Reprieve with the French setback. Le la. Hmm, I don't know that one. Withdrawing. Defecting or something. Careless remark about Nicole briefly. Nicole briefly lying low. I don't know. Agitated by trouble nuts, troubles require getting SOS out. Troubled nuts. Agitated. Troubles require getting SOS out. Hmm, can't quite see that. So this one, withdrawing curse remark. Defecting, something like that. Defacing. Um, ah, can't get stuck now. Reprieve with the French. I mean, the French is little land, that must go here. Reprieve. Oh, I don't know. They are rewarded being of real use at work. So what did we say about this one? Anagram of of real use. They are rewarded. So if that's an L, possibly, for little la. L, 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 something U. Laureates? Oh! I think it's an anagram of real use at rather than of real use, and we get laureates. Those are people with Nobel Prizes, aren't they? Laureates. If that's right, I think so. Slightly unusual anagram construction. I think that's right though. Let's go with that. Oh, let up. So the French is le set back. Oh, put backwards is set. I mean, yeah, put backwards and put and put means set. Okay. So this looks like effacing then. What does effacing mean? I don't know. Let's write it in and have a look. Does that mean withdrawing? I don't know. Careless remark about Nicole briefly lying low. And I see, is that Nicole? Lying low. Oh, careless remark, gaff. Nicole briefly is and I see. All of that backwards, withdrawing, and the whole thing must mean lying low then. Effacing means lying low. Okay. So this last one, uh, turbulent fits, troubles requiring getting SOS out. Let's write that in and see if anything happens. Nope, that one is done, isn't it? Yeah, turbulent. Troubled nuts. Troubles. No, I don't know. Let me know in the comments how that one works. Right, let's check all. Did I spell protesters wrong? Yes, I did. I'm an idiot. Sorry about that. 
Well, how about that? That was a fantastic puzzle, wasn't it? To get all those thematic things in there, that is superb. Absolutely brilliant. And um, I suppose, I wonder if this was written recently, because that would have been 50 years since that event, wouldn't it? I wonder if that's why. But wow, that was amazing. What a superb crossword. Some great clues there. Just the right difficulty for me, I find. But yeah, thanks, Ben, for sending me this on Facebook, and I'm, I'll be sure to do some more of your amazing puzzles. I do recommend everyone have a look at Ben's website. And um, yeah, let, let Ben know in the comments what you thought about this puzzle. I thought it was amazing. So that's it. Thanks for watching. Subscribe button's on the screen now if you'd like to see